Hi students, welcome back to online class. This is Charles Shekhar from Upper Public School. So dear students, you know that in last class we discussed the new chapter. You know that the name of this chapter is menstruation. Yes, my dear students, you know that menstruation means what? See, menstruation we discussed what is menstruation, measuring the distance from one end to the other end. So this menstruation. So in that uh, menstruation, we discussed the topic, this perimeter. So what is perimeter? You know, so perimeter means distance around the boundary that we discussed in the in class. It is in last class. Next, see in another word, perimeter means we discussed that is sum of all the sides. It is called as perimeter. See, we discussed the formulas regarding about uh, perimeter what is the perimeter of rectangle you know perimeter of rectangle that is p is equal to 2 into l plus b again we discussed the perimeter of a square the perimeter of a square formula is p is equal to 4 into side next we discussed a, another formula that is perimeter of a equilateral triangle equilateral means you know that is all three sides are equal so the formula is p is equal to 3 into side. The next is perimeter of a triangle. Triangle means if three sides are given different, that is called a scalene triangle. Is it or not? If all three sides are different, means we call it as scalene. If any two sides are equal in triangle, means that is called as isosceles. The formula is you know that is if three sides are different, means p is equal to if you are giving the names, means a, b, c. It is AB plus BC plus CA. That is the perimeter of a triangle formula. Next, we discuss the regular closed figures. So, what are regular closed figures? The figures which are in equal sides and are equal angles are called as regular closed figures. That means the figures which are having same sides and same angles are called as regular closed figures. We discuss the regular closed figures. This triangle is a regular closed figure. Square is a regular closed figure. Pentagon. Pentagon means how many sides? Five sides. Hexagon. Hexagon means six sides. Heptagon means seven sides. Octagon means eight sides. Nanogon means nine sides. Which is Decagon means ten sides. Is it or not, students? Now, in last class, we discussed it up to 14th problem. That is in exercise number 10.1. We discussed it up to a 14th problem. Now, today's students, we are going to discuss about the next one, that is 15th one. Yes, I will read the question. This is the question. See, we are discussing the 10th lesson, that is menstruation. Okay. So what is the 15th question? Okay. So I will read the question. Just listen the 15th one. So sweetie runs around a square park of side. See, 15th one, we are discussing the students. Here too, you should open the test and see what the question I am reading. Okay. See, up to 14th, we did uh, in the last class. Now today we are going to discuss about the 15th and remaining. See students, Sweetie runs around a square park. See Sweetie runs around a square park of side 75 meter. For example, Sweetie. See, she runs a square park. See, square park of, uh, you know, one side is 75 meters. Square park. She, she distance uh, the she runs a, around a square park of 75 meters. You know, square on all four sides are equal. Yes. Next, bulbul runs around a rectangular park. See, bulbul. Here is the bulbul. See, bulbul runs a rectangular park. See, rectangular park. See, rectangular park. You know, this is the length. Okay, you know, this is the breadth. Okay. See, rectangular park of length given 60 meter and the breadth given. How much? 
45 meter. Okay. Now, who covers less distance? Who covers less distance? Okay. Now, who covers less distance? First, distance covered by CVT. First, we should find out the CVT. So, distance covered. So, distance covered by CVT is equal to she covers the distance in a square path. Is it done? That's why we should find out the perimeter of a square. <coughs> That is equal to perimeter of a so perimeter of a square. You know perimeter of a square formula? 4 into side. They give side value how much? 4 into 75. So 4 into 75, how much? Just to multiply 4 into 7, 4 by the 22 carrier, 0 here. So 4 7 the 28 plus 2. That is 300. They give in units meter, you should write meter. Is 300 meter. Next, coming back to bulbul. Okay. Next, distance covered by bulbul. <coughs> so distance covered by. So distance covered by bulbul is equal to. See rectangle. That means perimeter of rectangle. See perimeter of uh, rectangle. You know the formula. Perimeter of rectangle. So what is the formula of perimeter of rectangle? Two into L plus B. Now 2 into length given how much? 60. Breadth given 45. You know 2 into length 60 plus 45, 105. If you multiply it to 2, see 2, 5 is 10. See 10 as is 2 and 2. If you multiply 0, it's 0 only. Okay. 2, 5 is 10. Okay, one carry means 2, 5 is 10. 0 here, 1 here. 2, 0 is 0, 1 is 1. 2, 1 is 2. See here 45 minutes. 210 meter per bulbul and per speed is 300 meter. Now they are asking who covers less distance. 300 meter less or 210 meter is less. Therefore, bulbul bulbul covers less distance. Understood students? Who covers less distance? See, speed is 300. Bulbul is 210. Who covers less distance? Bulbul covers the less distance. Understood students? See, this is about 15 one. Understood students? Yes. Next is 16th one. So next is the 16th one. So what is the perimeter? I'll read the question, understand the question. What is the perimeter of each of the following figures? What do you infer from the answers? Now, in the 16th, A1 will discuss. So this is 25 centimeter. Here also 25 they given. Here also 25. Here also 25. So what is the shape of this figure? The shape of this figure is square. You know perimeter of square formula. So it is perimeter of a square. So perimeter of a square is equal to 4 into side. 4 into side. So one side is almost 25. Remaining all sides are same. So 4, 25. Multiply 4, 4, 5, 20, 2, carry your way Okay. 4, 2, 8, plus 2, 10. See, 100 centimeter. Understood students? So, next one is B1. So, you know, this is the length. This is the length, this is the breadth. See, 10 centimeter, 40 centimeter is 40 by 10. Here also 40. Here 10 centimeter. Okay, what is the shape of this figure? It's rectangle. You know perimeter of rectangle is perimeter of a rectangle is equal to 2 into L plus B. Now 2 into L by how much? 40. The B value is 10. 2 into 50. 250 is I know. That is 
three slabs of size. For example, this side you see one, two, three. Three slabs of size. That is one by two meter. Three slabs of size. That is one by two meter. <coughs> oh, for example, you give the names A, B, C, D. Okay. You know this is in, it is in the form of a square. No, A B is equal to A B is equal to C. <coughs> A B is equal to A B is equal to. See how many slabs of sides here? Three slabs of sides. This three into one by two. Three into one by two. Three into one by two is three by two. That is three by two. Okay. Once again, let's do. Each side has three slabs of sides. For example, A B you see one side, second side, third side. Each side has three slabs of sides. That is one by two meter. One by two, one by two, one by two much. Three by two meter. Okay. Next is what is the perimeter of the arrangement? Now, perimeter. So the arrangement is in the form of a square. Now, perimeter of a square. You know that four into five. Now we got the side one side value is how much? Three by two. Four into three by two. If you do cancellation from two tables, two and the two two is a four. Now we get two three da. Two three is how much? Six three da. How much? Six. Now we get the perimeter of this arrangement. Six meter. See, here I have explained. Okay. Two one da. Two two da four. Okay. What is the side value we got? Three by. Each side has three slabs. Upside one by two. That is three into one by two three by. Side we got the value. That is four into three by two one da. Two to the four, two three the six meter. This is the first one. This is the perimeter of the cylinder. It is six meter. Understood? Yes. So next one is second. See so the second one. See so the second one. That is B. I will draw the second figure. So, like this is there the figure. Yes, we are giving the names here A, B, okay, then C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, Y. Yeah. Okay, now here yeah. it is also in the form of a square, you see. Okay, so see what is the key question? Sherry, so Sherry does not like his arrangement. That means the his first arrangement he does not like. That means she gets him to lay them out like a cross. What is the perimeter of our arrangement? So what is the perimeter of this arrangement? See now, you know, A B so perimeter is sum of all the sides. C A B plus B C plus you know each side is how much? One by two meter. Okay, you know each side is how much? One by two meter. See here, also. here one by two, one by two. Here AB is one by two. Okay, here to here one by two. See here to here one by two. Therefore, one by two plus one by two. That is two by two. Two by two means one. Okay. Now AB plus BC plus CD plus DE plus EF plus next FG plus GH plus HI plus okay IJ plus plus JK plus plus K yeah okay then LA plus 
PLA. Now, A means up, KG means up, D means up, HG means up, like this. Okay? So, remaining all this 1, 1, 1. So, AB is 1 by 2 plus. Again, BC means 1. So B to C is 1. 1 by 2, 1 by 2, I said no. That is 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. It is 2 by 2. It is equal to 1. Then C to D. This also 1 by 2. This also 1 by 2. 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. 2 by 2 is 1. Again, even CD also 1. Plus D, how much? 1 by 2. Because each side has 3 slabs of sides. That is 1 by 2 meter. Okay. Next D over P to F. Again, 1 by 2, 1 by 2. That is 2 by 2. That is 1. Plus F to G. Again, 1. 1 by 2, 1 by 2. That is 2 by 2, 1. Then GH. GH is 1. Then H high. H high is also 1. Plus IJ. It is also 1. Plus. Then JK. R. That is 1 by 2. It is only 1 by 2. Is it or not? See, you want HJ also, GH also 1 by 2. Okay. Next, KL. Okay. KL, how much? That is 1. Plus. LA, how much? 1. One second, you see, my students. See, each side is 3 slabs of size. That is 1 by 2 meter. They give 1 by 2 meter. AB is 1 by 2 meter. Again, D is also 1 by 2. GH are 3 also 1 by 2. KJ are 3 also 1 by 2. Remaining all 1, 1, 1. C are 1 by 2. AB 1 by 2. BC 1. CD is also 1. Next, D is 1 by 2. Then EF is 1. Then FG is 1. Then GH. See, AB plus BC plus CD plus DE plus EF plus EF. So once again, don't confuse this. See, AB is 1 by 2. BC 1, CD 1. Okay. Then DE is 1 by 2. Then EF is 1. Plus FG, how much? It is also 1. Plus GH, how much? 1 by 2. Plus H I how much? 1. Plus I J how much? 1. Plus J K how much? 1 by 2. K L how much? 1. Plus L A how much? 1. Now you to see students. How many 1 by 2s? So here 1, here 2, 3, 4. 4 1 by 2s are there. That means 1 by 2, 1 by 2, you know, 1. Okay. See, 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. Plus 1 by 2, plus 1 by 2, plus now you count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 are there. 1, so many are there? 8 are there. Now you know this uh, 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2. 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2, how much? 2 by 2 is 1. Plus, again 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2, that is 2 by 2, that is value is 1. That is 8. 1 plus 1 plus 8. How much? 1 plus 1, 2. 2 plus 8 is how much? 10. There is this meter. 10 meter. This side is second arrangement understood, students. Okay. Each side is 3 slabs of size. That is 1 by 2 meter. The remaining is this 1 by 2, 1 by 2. That means from, from here to here, 1 by 2. Here to here, 1 by 2. 1 by 2, 1 by 2. It's 2 by 2. That is 1. Understood, students? See, here how many 1 by 2s are there? 4. See, 1 by 2, 1 by 2, 1 by 2, 1 by 2. First 1 by 2 plus 1 by 2, you know 1. That is 2 by 2 is equal to 1 is the answer we did already. You can say this is also 1. If you are to get 10 meter. Understood students? This is all about D question. The 17th, D. Understood students? Yes. So next one is C. So next one is C, 17th on C. So what is the C question? Which is, which has greater perimeter? Which has greater perimeter? So which has greater perimeter students? See, first one. First arrangement has the value how much? 6 meter. Second arrangement is value how much? 10 meter. Which has greater 6 or 10? Yes, 10. 10 is the correct answer. Which has greater arrangement? That means, 
arrangement arrangement two has greater arrangement two has greater perimeter understood students yes this is the c one next d one what is the d one see how many wonders if there is a way of getting an even greater perimeter can you find a way of doing this that means i mean once there is a way of getting an even great like they give the paying slabs must meet along complete edges they cannot be broken now see yes the ball squares are arranged in a row the perimeter should be 10 meter see yes the ball squares are arranged in a row see if all squares if all squares are arranged see if all squares are arranged in a row the perimeter should be the perimeter should be the perimeter be 10 meter understood students okay i'll explain this one again to see how many wonders if there is a way of getting an even greater perimeter yes of course can you find a way of doing this how to find means yes the first phase are arranged in a row row means this is the row okay the perimeter be 10 meter understood students yes this is all about the exercise 10.1 i hope you all understood it yes yes we will discuss the next topic yes in the mensuration chapter Ah, we completed first exercise that is 10.1. Now we will discuss the second topic in this lesson. So the name of this topic is the name of this topic is area. What is area? So what is area? See area means what? So for example, see you know perimeter. What is perimeter? Yes, perimeter means distance around the boundary. Okay, we discussed the formulas of perimeter of rectangle, perimeter of a square, perimeter of a equilateral triangle, so perimeter of a only triangle. Okay. Now we are discussing the area. What is area? Okay. You see students. So what is area? For example, I wrote here rectangle. I draw a rectangle here. You know it is a rectangle. Okay. You know it is a square. Okay. You know it is a triangle. See what is area? Area means what? Area means the amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure. See this is all about area. See the amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure. It is a closed figure. It's a regular closed figure. See the amount of surface is there one inside. The amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure. This called as area. So this is called as area. So this is called as area. What is area? The amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure is called as area. Understood? Now we discuss the formulas of area of rectangle. You know area of rectangle formula. So this is you know that is length. Okay. This is you know length. The rectangle upper side is equal. See this is breadth. So the area of rectangle means. In area of rectangle, that is length into breadth. Length into breadth. Now we know area of square formula. A is equal to side into side. It is S into S. Or side into side. We write down side into side. Okay. You know area of triangle formula. Area of triangle, you know half into base into height. Half into base into height. So this is all about area. Area means what? Area means the amount of surface enclosed by a closed figure 
is called as area. So this is all about the area of rectangle formula. Area of rectangle is called length into breadth. Area of square formula is side into side. So area of triangle formula half into base into height. Okay. Yes. See here the units are square units. See for example, uh, here in the rectangle, for example, right, length two centimeter given, breadth four centimeter given. See here the units are two four eight you know centimeter into centimeter centimeter square. That means what are the units of area means square units. See what are the units of area means square units. Whereas in the perimeter, the only units, the centimeter means centimeter, meter means meter, kilometer means kilometer. Whereas in area, doubles, the centimeter into centimeter means centimeter square, that's the square units required. Meter into meter, meter square, kilometer into kilometer, kilometer square, like this. Side into side, here also, for example, one meter into one meter. So one meter into one meter, that is one meter square. One one java, that is meter square, like this. Understood students? Yes. <clears throat> this is understood students area. I hope you all understood, I think. Yes. In the next class, we will continue with the next topic and in the next exercise, 10.6. I hope you are all understood, I think. Yes. Thank you.